Hello everyone, it's your favorite channel, Denisonic Telecoms. Welcome today. Welcome to today. So today I'm going to be teaching you how to flash any Android 10, Android 11, Android 12, or any MTK new latest CPU with SP flash to you. I know it will sound very strange to you, but possible, nothing's possible. In this DSM work, so today I'm going to teach you how to flash any latest Android phone with SP Flash 2. So let's get started. You can download these tools from my description link. You quickly launch your SP Flash 2. I'm using the test SP Flash 2. So the SP flash to version five point five point uh, one nine two four. Then you also download this one MTK out bypass. All of them link is in my description. Then you download the software of the phone you want to flash. Then you download the DFI which is also in my video description. So most phones are secured with DA file. So in case the phone you want to flash, the DA file in this description does not match. You can also search Google. You can also search Google for DA file. You will be able to match your device. So currently, I listed a DA file that will match most common devices around now. So, get the phone firmware. Once you get the phone firmware, just follow the steps. Like my phone, I want to format and download new chip, new OS. So, first of all, choose the DA file. It's the infinite phone. I want to flash. So, I'm choosing this DA file. Maybe it will work, maybe it will not work. In case you get error choosing DA file, you go to option, then you untick check lib DA match. Because if this is checked, that DA file will not be able to tick. So you untick it and you go back. Then you choose your phone ROM. This is my phone ROM. If it is S688, this is running on Android 11. If it is S688, Android 11 is the phone you need to format. So, I want to format it before I download. So, I choose format plus download. Then, before you connect the device, you'll be able to lose the phone because the phone will, from, um, will break. Then, you will unbreak it with this also. So you lose the device so that you have access to the battery then before you connect it you hold the volume up and the volume down so that the phone will be connected in broom mode then you first of all click on disable out then you hold the volume up and volume down while you plug in the usb cable the system has dictated it you can see i have bypassed out then i can click download now then I'll be able to format the device. Yeah, device format successful. Then I can now download download only. Then you lose the phone, unclip the battery head, and clip it back again. You also repeat the step. 
disable odds bypass but volume down and volume up and connect the cable now you can flash your phone successfully please subscribe to my youtube channel and also like my videos share my videos with all your friends yeah i'm getting this error because i did not untick some things in the tkv and all the rest of it so after i'll be able to flash the file to the phone so flash your phone successfully and also subscribe to my youtube and there uh, is your favorite boy don't panic Before you flash any file, ensure the file is tested and trusted. If you need any file, you can contact me via my WhatsApp number. WhatsApp number on the screen. Any file at all you need, just contact me. I said tested flash. Also, remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel, like my videos.
so thank you for watching the video and see flash is successful my phone is okay now i can boot it up phone is okay now phone is formatted plus download so in case you formatted your device you'll be getting some errors like uh, invalid ime so watch under my video you will still see how to write imb to latest mtp thank you for watching please subscribe